Hello, my name is Sander Buchheim and welcome to this video series. It is a long time since I've made uh, any videos and this time it won't be about Unity, but we are going to create a game. We are going to create a board game with Node.js and Angular and the game is called Codenames, as you can see here in my screen already. We are going to create a Node.js backend with Socket.io and Express and we are using Angular for the front-end system and Angular Material and Socket.io client for the connection to it. Yeah, when you have never heard about Codenames, just google it, uh, there are the rules online. Codenames is a board game and it's pretty fun. You can uh, connect with your friends uh, through Discord or TeamSpeak and uh, do the game online too. Uh, our site Codenames already have an official online version of it. Uh, we are just doing a copy of it. It won't be an exact same game, but um, so ex actually it won't have all the features uh, Codenames has in, but we, you can play with it and uh, you will be able to play with your friends um, over it. So let's take a look at the official game. We can create a room and type our nickname in, create the room, and after this we can copy the link for our friends. We're doing this and I join as an operative now. And after this I will join with a different browser on a different monitor into this game and join as a spy master. Now I can start the game and both uh, players see their their cards. Uh, the spy master sees sees all the colors. So actually, when you're team red, you you have to explain the red cards, and but team blue needs to explain the blue cards as spy master, and the operative needs to guess which uh, words are meant. Um, we are doing it pretty similar. Uh, let's take a look at our version we are going to create. We are doing a very simple yeah, front-end system, actually. We have a small button where you can press create game, and we are going to create a normal uh, string here, which you can send your friends uh, after that. And when you're calling the same, URL, you're just uh, connecting to it. Me as a host, uh, I can see that a new player joined and when I press start game, uh, the game starts. As you can see, the other tab also has the same the same uh, words. And you as a player, you can just decide if you are operat operative or spy master. When you're spy master, you can see all the colors. Um, when you press next game, it will switch over to operative, otherwise uh, you're not able to switch between the roles. Um, yeah, after that you can just decide again if you're a spy master or operative. You as an operative, you can click on it and you can see which color it's getting uh, transferred over. So when I'm spy master here, you can see that the yeah, me as an operative, I've clicked on sister. When I'm doing the same for university, it's getting red, and for the spy master, it's getting uh, red too, so that I know the player has clicked on the on the word. When I'm doing this as a spy master, I'm not able to click anything. It's only possible as an operative. And yeah, after this, we can press next game if the game is over and we are getting a new uh, new words. And this will be the game, and I hope you have fun. Just leave me a subscribe and uh, a like. If you have some questions, just leave me a comment down below, 